Good morning, good YouTube people. Captain Lope in with you. Quick little dumpster haul this morning. Only had two spots that gave anything up. Got four boxes of Cool Pops. And, uh, you know, I'm sure there's a couple of them there broken. You know, I'll have to clean them up. I've been scoring a lot of Cool Pops lately. A couple of VO5 shampoos. A little bit of uh, well, a multi surface cleaner in there, but. Some of those bottles are broke, most of them have leaked out. I'd probably get, you know, the equivalent of one bottle of it. I put it all together, so I had something. Fancy hand soap, tropical coconut and citrus, sidewalk chalk for the kitties, uh, some Toy Story soap, and Spider Man hand soap. It's funny, I didn't get any woody soap. Funny story when my son was a little bit younger. I came home from work one morning and he wanted to know what a Woody was. Because apparently he'd been watching Toy Story with my wife and told her that she wanted a Woody. <laughs> apparently she busted out laughing pretty bad. Got some pencils and paper clips. But anyhow, eventually I broke down and I told him, you know, when you look at a pretty girl and the old fella gets stiff, well, that's. That's a Woody. And the funny thing is, you ask your mom to give you one. <laughs> so he kind of embarrassed himself there. But yeah, I got a Hula Girl on a spring. And I got her feet. And there, you know, if you like Hula Girl's feet, well, there you go. Yeah, pencils, hair clips, paper clips. Picked up this uh, casserole thing here, but unfortunately, the casserole dish itself, pretty busted up. And it came with this little hot cold pack, so you can keep your stuff hot or cold, but it leaks. There's a lid and a insulated carrying case for it. So I have a lid and an insulated carrying case now. Got an entire case of light bulbs. And some of these have a broken light bulb in the package. But it's a whole case. And my I do have a lot of light bulbs. Another thing I have a lot of anymore is glasses. This has one wine glass in it, and uh, there was one broken one and one good one in it, in a four-pack box. 25 years guaranteed, titanium reinforced. Got another set of glasses in here too. One of those was broken. But, you know, hey, it's a, it's a pretty nice set though. Something I can probably yard sale. Some cheap strawberry, well, they call it fruit spread, jelly, jam, whatever. And I came up with a pretty good idea with this stuff the other day. I was making some uh, jalapeno poppers, just some little cheapos, you know, throw them in the toaster oven. And I wanted to make a sauce with them. And I remember Arby's used to have a Bronco Berry sauce for their jalapeno poppers. And so I simmered some of this down with some balsamic vinegar in it and really turned out quite outstanding you know let it simmer for a good long time reduce that balsamic vinegar and you've got a great uh, jalapeno popper dip going on and another thing that that would be good on believe it or not is uh, vanilla ice cream and take it up a weird notch uh, fresh cracked black pepper on it it actually quite amazing you know I've figured out how to do that with other kinds of fruit as well uh, bananas blueberries blackberries balsamic vinegar cook it down it's actually quite good on ice cream you'd be surprised and don't forget the fresh cracked black peppers where does that sounds boy it it does it it goes with it got the uh, apple pie filling number cards some little crafty popsicle stick type stuff and my mother-in-law goes and works at the pre-release center, kind of like a halfway house for ladies, and does crafts with them. She might be able to use those there. And I got another Keurig, and I haven't tried this one out yet. The, uh, the return slip on it says that it leaks, so I'll have to try that out and see if it works. Lord knows I need another Keurig. I'm getting overwhelmed by Keurigs, but I'm sure I'll find someone who would like them. And, sort of the, the big ta-da of today's haul is a temper 
temper foam mattress pad and this was actually it was actually cleaner than that before I put it in the truck but the back of the truck's a little dirty so I'm pretty sure that'll just wipe right off and I'll have a temper foam pad and I think uh, I think we already put one on my son's bed and a feather topper on his bed so I don't think he wants it but if it's a full size one I take it to work because uh, I'm one of the fortunate people who actually gets to sleep on my on the, on the job pretty lucky really so uh, our mattresses up there aren't that comfortable though so I might try that throw it on top of it and see if we get a little more comfort there but anyhow good YouTube people it was just a just a quick little dive today only two places that really give anything up uh, I considered not diving for the summer but yeah I can't stop you know it's an addiction. I'm hooked. I know. Uh, Y'all have a good day. Carpe Garbage.